Hey everyone, Technomentary here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix image wand not working on your iPhone. So let's get started. So first thing is you need to make sure that you have a compatible device in order to get image wand to work. So I mean by that is you need a phone or a device that has Apple Intelligent. For iPhone, you need to have iPhone 15 Pro, 15 Pro Max, or any of the new iPhone 16 lineup. Along with that is you need to update your phone to iOS 18.2 or a newer version. So in your settings, go to general, software update, and check your update has been updated to iOS 18.2 or a newer version. Now after you have done that, the next thing you want to do in your settings, there should be an option that's Apple Intelligence here. You need to ensure that it is turned on. Now if you can't turn on Apple Intelligent, you'll need to do two things here. You need to make sure your phone in your settings Right in the main setting, go to general. iPhone store, it has at least four gigs available. If you don't have four gigs available, Apple Intelligent might not work correctly. So at least have four gigs available here. You can delete older videos and photos in order to clear up some space if you need to. Now, along with that, in your settings general, you also want to ensure that language and region, you're in a supported language for Apple Intelligent. For example, United States region and English are the preferred ones. There are other other regions and languages that are supported, but I usually use these as a baseline. And then after that, in your settings, you want to ensure Apple Intelligent is again turned on. Now, once you have all these requirements, you have a phone or a device that's compatible on iOS 18.2 or newer. In order to use the image one, you're going to want to go ahead and open up your notes. Right, let's go ahead and open up notes. You tap on a new note, then matter, and then that will give you the option to like, for example, if you were to draw something. So let's go ahead and use this. If I were to draw something like a house here, and then I want to use that one. It's right here. As you can see here, it's a set of two. I can tap on that here, and then I could do like a circle or something like that. And you can also type in stuff here like house example and it takes whatever image you have with the description and generate you an image or multiple images and then you can go ahead and save this note go back here select it and you can see here now I have converted a drawing into house itself and this is how this image one is used on your device so that's how you do it I hope this video is helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.